The purpose of this video is to demonstrate gate on barai or down block. There are several different ways that you can fold and there are also several different positions you can end in when you're doing a down block. For the purpose of this video, I'm going to demonstrate the way that I teach it to my students and with our ending position being just in front of our leg. So when you're dealing with different types of martial arts, your chamber position can vary. Um, so again, for this video, just what I am teaching my students. For all of our blocks, our final ending chamber position is going to be up on the side of our bodies with our forearm being parallel to the ground. So you don't want your arm down here by your waist and you also don't want your fist tucked up by your chest with your elbow pointing down. So you want to create that nice straight line. Our ending position is also going to have our arm down here. To begin with our down block, we actually have to fold first to help us generate speed and momentum to get to the blocking position to stop the technique. So our blocking hand in this case is going to be our left hand. It is going to come up. Our right hand is actually going to come across our bodies. So our goal here is to protect our body during the fold. Once we begin to initiate the block, I'm gonna demonstrate the, what the blocking arm does and then I'll demonstrate the chamber hand. The blocking arm is going to swing down following the hinge of the elbow to come down into the blocking position. So it starts here and moves in a semicircular pattern. The chamber hand is going to go from across the body to chamber position. So moving both arms together, Now I'm going to demonstrate doing the block with my right hand. So now my right hand is going to come up and my left hand is going to come across the body and they'll still follow that same line of movement. It's just on the opposite side of the body. Now when we're going from one hand to the other, which generally tends to be the easiest way to practice, as opposed to just doing the same side over and over again, you will switch sides and rotate through your blocks. So, we'll start with our left hand up and our right hand across our body. We'll move both arms together into that blocking position. Then we're going to switch. So when we switch, our hand that's in chamber, which is currently our right hand, will come up and our left hand is going to come across the body. And then both arms will move to get into the blocking position. And then we'll just continue that rotation pattern as we practice. Now, doing the blocks at a faster speed. With our goal being to get a lot of speed and snap into that technique. And that is Gedan Barai or down block. 